Hey friends, this is Atif. Hope you're well and welcome to the new update on Unify Protocol. As in my previous videos of Unify Protocol, I've been showing you that first it broke out a very long term down channel and after that it also broke out the resistance of the triangle as well. And this was one of those videos. And now if we take a look at the live weekly time frame chart, then you can see that after breaking out this next triangle, we had a nice pump. By the way, the target for the breakout from this triangle uh, was here. And that was approximately at uh, $16 and 47 cents. And you can see that the price end moved very close to hit that target, but got rejected by this long-term resistance of $15 that had been previously breaking other resistance here and resistance here. And now again, it broke as a strong resistance and the price end dropped down. And by the way, during this all move, you can see that we also have the formation of head and shoulder pattern as well, like this of the left shoulder and the head and the right shoulder of this head and shoulder pattern and this was the neckline of this head and shoulder pattern and we have broken down the neckline of this uh, head and shoulder pattern and the target to the downside uh, for this breakdown uh, was here that was approximately at $2.27 and you can see that the price end moved very close to hit that target by the way here we have a quite long term support of $2.50 and the price end could not break it down and they covered back very soon and right now it is testing this quite long term support zone that starts from $3.88 and goes to $3.42. By the way, previously uh, this support zone has been breaking as a uh, support and resistance on here, support zone here for stable weeks a month, and here as a resistance zone for two weeks, and here as a support. And again, you can see it is breaking as a nice support. Despite this long spike to the downside, up to $2.50 support, the price and could not break down this support zone. And now it is getting accumulated here. And in today's video, we will also analyze this move. And I would also like to show you this very, very massive resistance of Ichimoku bearish cloud as well. You can see that the price line was about to break the upper bands of this uh, Ichimoku bearish cloud, but could not break out the upper bands and got rejected by this resistance of upper bands and moved down. And now we will need to break out this resistance of Ichimoku bearish cloud as well. But before starting this analysis, if you're not subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe it. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member, because there I'm sharing different trading signals for you. And you can find a link to join me there in the video description I've shared. And if you would like to see how my trading signals work, then I've also shared the link for the trading signal report in the video description. You just need to open that report. And if you would like to check or verify any trading signal like this, the trade setup for FIS, you just need to click on the link for the trade setup. And it will take you to the trading view chart. And on this chart, you can see when I shared this signal, like in this case, I shared this signal on 28th of March, 2024. You can also watch the complete trade setup as well. Like this was buying zone and sell target zone and the stop loss. And in order to see how the price line moved after sharing this signal, you need to click this button. And after that, it will show you how the price line moved up from the buying zone and rallied to the sell target zone. Now, let me to take you to the live chart of Unify Protocol. And this is the weekly time frame chart. And here you can see that previously it was moving inside this quite long term down channel. And I've been telling you that once uh, Unify Protocol will be able to break out this down channel, the target to the outside will be here, possibly uh, between $45 to $50. And you can see that the price and pumped up to $41.79. By the way, uh, from this low, when it was uh, having this spike to the downside up till this high, it recovered more than 3,061%. But despite this long pump, the price end could not break out these three significant resistance levels. One was here at $15 and $20 and $37. And after the rejection, the price end formed this descending triangle. And now recently we have broken out this triangle as well, but could not break out the $15 resistance and also broke down uh, the neckline of this head and shoulder pattern as well. And now it is getting accumulated at this support zone. This is very significant support zone uh, that starts from $3.88 and goes to $3.42. At the same time, we also have a bullish divergence flash on this weekly time frame chart. As you can see that the price line is forming lower than previous low. But at the same time, stochastic is moving up and it is forming higher lows than previous low. And you can see that it has also entered the oversold zone as well. Therefore, there is a very high probability that the price end may not break down this support zone and it may try to break out the next resistance of $5 very soon. Now, if we take a look at the targets, then target for the breakout from this descending triangle uh, was here. 
Uh, that was approximately at $17.80. And you can see that the price line is almost about to hit that target. Uh, almost has hit that target. And now if we take a look at the final target for this very, very massive breakout from this down channel. By the way, uh, when the price line will start another reversal from here, then we will also need to break out this very massive resistance of Ichimoku uh, cloud as well. But this time, this cloud, cloud is quite weak. You can see that previously it was a very huge and strong bearish cloud. There, but this time... It is V cloud, therefore it will be easy for the price and to break out this cloud. And this time, the resistance of the cloud will be approximately at $8.60. Now, the target for the breakout uh, is here uh, from this channel. That is at the top of the channel between $45 to $50. So this was the update so far. I hope that you have liked the analysis. Then do hit the like and do subscribe to the channel as well. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member. Because there I'm sharing different trading signals for you. And you can find a link to join me there in the video's description I've shared. Take care. Goodbye.